Promised in time for the holidays, Intel pushed Ultrabooks at its developer forum in San Francisco this week. Ultrabook is an Intel trademark name for systems that meet certain specifications for thickness, battery life, and processing power, for example. They're designed for people who want more functionality than a tablet, but still need something fast and lightweight. So these systems are going to be based on the Sandy Bridge processor, the Huron River platform um, that will be in market for the um, holiday season. So what that means is that you're going to get all the goodness that's built into our second gen core processor family in this ultra stylish form factor, um, including with the, the um, processor graphics that are built into every Sandy Bridge or second gen core processor. You're going to get all that media processing capability, technologies like Intel Wireless Display, um, Intel Insider, Intel Quick Sync Video. Ultrabooks will come from a number of manufacturers, including Toshiba, Acer, Asus, and others. Intel has laid out plans for processor upgrades for Ultrabooks in the next few years. So next year we're going to be introducing Ivy Bridge in, into the market. Um, that is based, that's the same basic architecture that we have on Sandy Bridge today, but with the same compaction onto our 22 nanometer process technology with those really cool 3D transistors that you may have heard about. And even with Ivy Bridge coming next year, Intel is already looking to 2013 and the introduction of a new chip that will be even more power efficient. I would like to share with you some information about Haswell, the next next generation microprocessor. It's going to deliver 20x power improvement, more than 10 days connected standby. All day battery life will not have to use the power supply. And this is enabled by the Intel Power Optimizers, where we'll have to work with us and with the ecosystem in order to deliver this great experience. With reporting by Agam Shah, I'm Nick Barber, IDG News Service.